Well, uh, it's something a little lighter here. Instagram worthy art. It's popping up in more public spaces, spaces across North Texas. You look closely at this and you might see a trend. Many of the pieces are the work of a Dallas artist leaving his mark and his message. Our Jennifer Lindgren shares the work of Kyle Steed in this week's Ones for Texas. It's whether or not we know it, when we pass a piece on the street, it, I think it affects us. Walk by one of his massive murals. Kyle Steed hopes you'll take away more than just a pretty picture. I think people spend too much time uh, looking for inspiration. Instead, he says, let the inspiration find you. We use our hands every day for things, and I think using them for, for strength and for unity is, is just a really important message. His expressions start with paper and pencil and end up in places like the roof of the Plaza of the Americas building. So I had to carry all my scaffolding up. This 100-foot-wide painting of woven hands taps into the unity he felt in Dallas after the July 2016 police ambush. And after hearing Chief Brown talk, and it really kind of influenced and affected me. Steed never went to art school, just grew up doodling and painting, but his aesthetic is turning heads. Brand collaborations, restaurant groups, small businesses, and cities all commissioning his work. He sees North Texas as supportive of these large scale projects. People working for the city that want to see, you know, more color, more vibrancy added, and not just a, a blank wall or not just putting up a, an advertisement. Like the organic shapes that move across his canvas, Steed sees public art and his own art as constant evolution. You have a chance, you have a voice to say something, and so why not use it um, to say something positive? In Dallas, Jennifer Lindgren, CBS 11 News. We could use more of that positive, right? Steed's latest art installation, it opens today behind the bar at the brand new 60 Vines restaurant in Uptown Dallas. He's also working on an illustrated children's book. For more of his art, just head to cbsdfw.com, click on the Ones for Texas. Tomorrow,